we were like, yeah. whoa, because we sang the song The X Factor, and because we'd already done Queen the week before, we were like, oh my god, we need to spice it up. And because Vanilla Ice had the same backing track that we like, it's kind of weird because we're practicing and singing it to the actual original artist, and he knows the song better than anyone. Like he's he, in the he's in the backstage, and he's like, it's like rock a stage, like, and he's like, it's so cool. Like, it's kind of cool. Think about it. He wrote this song when he was like our age, so it's kind of cool. He was 16 when he wrote it, and he released it when he was like, do you know what I mean like he's yeah. real talented? No, he's, he's, actually, loads of he's actually done so much. It's like that over here in the UK, most people don't know about it. In America, he's still big. Like Wait, he's he's cashing in on your fame. Huh? No, he's not. No, I think it's a really cool he's performance. He's a legend in his like own time. He's like the original like gangster like, rapper. Like he's from he's from the 90s, and it's kind of cool that it's 2010 and that we have an opportunity to perform with like a really, like, really cool icon. Like the thing about icon. it is that the song is so amazing that you could release it in 20 years and it's still been a, a number one hit. Like everyone knows, it's like ice, ice. It's an amazing song that Queen originally wrote, and then um, Vanilla Ice like used the beat and everything. Like it's great that we're combining both songs to make the ultimate song. And yeah. is Simon Carl being nice to you now? Uh, everyone's always nice to us, aren't they? You guys are nice to us all the time. It's like a little ghetto thing going on here.